Yo, what is going on guys? It is Distra Trending here, bringing you guys this brand new video. Now in this video, we're going to be covering over the crazy diss track that Eminem just released on MGK called Killshot. Make sure you guys watch this video all the way through so then you really know what this diss response is actually about. Because there's probably a few lines that went over your head. But now finally, we're getting something from Eminem that's a response to MGK's diss song that he put out called Rap Devil. And I honestly think that Eminem won this battle. If you guys think that Eminem won this battle as well, be sure to leave a like on this video right now because I am kind of curious how many people watching this think that Eminem won. In this rap diss from Eminem, he just released and he covers all of the points basically that MGK said in his Rap Devil song. And Eminem even admitted himself that there is no point that MGK is even dissing him just because all the disses that MGK made about Eminem really don't even matter. MGK put out a lot of things in his diss song talking about how his old age and how the old Slim Shady can't stand up and things like that but the lines that Eminem just said in his diss response basically covers all of that and which is I'm going to be telling you guys right now. Now Eminem says the lines in his diss response saying my lowest hits are your biggest hits. Now this is something I had to do research about and this is one of the biggest facts that I've probably ever heard in my life. Now all of Eminem's lowest played songs on YouTube still have more plays than MGK's highest hits. Which is why I believe that MGK never should have even came at Eminem. Just because Eminem is an OG but I do understand where MGK was coming from. He kind of wanted to stand up for himself and what he believed in which was his music. So I do understand that 100% don't get me wrong but... Coming at an OG with such hatred and a diss song probably wasn't the best thing because now that Eminem just released this song, it could potentially ruin MGK's, you know, career. It ruined a lot of friendships because now, you know, who's going to really want to be friends with someone that Eminem just put into the ground, you know, things like that. Now, Eminem also says in this song, and I quote, I'm 45 and I'm still out selling you. When I was 29, I had three albums out of the blue. Now this line probably did kind of go over a lot of your guys' heads and let me tell you why. Now Eminem's Kamikaze album right now is on pace to do 500,000 sales within the next few days. Which is which is crazy, like it's that's just crazy numbers if you guys don't know. MGK, yeah sure he's young but he is coming nowhere near those numbers. I don't think MGK's ever sold 500,000 album sales in his whole career. And yes, Eminem is 46 years old and MGK is 29, but Eminem is still outselling him. So I obviously see where Eminem's coming from on this point. When Eminem was 29, he mentions that he had three albums that were out of the blue, which if you guys do not know, means that they went viral and things like that. So they absolutely took over the rap industry. I don't think MGK has actually had an album that done that. I've been in the rap scene for a pretty long time and this is honestly, like I've heard of MGK before, but I haven't like seen any of his songs like go super super viral so that's just another line that really makes sense in this now eminem makes a ton more lines in his diss song that's basically just basically counterpointing everything that mgk said everything still goes back to where eminem's old age and i want to know your guys' opinion on this does old age even really matter you know does old age like eminem is 46 years old he's basically he has the number one album right now in the world so clearly old age shouldn't even matter, especially to a lyrical rapper, because yeah, he's 46, doesn't look like it though, you know, like if you listen to his Kamikaze album, he still raps just like he did back in the day at 8 Mile and things like that, so like, I honestly don't really see a difference, and I don't really see why MGK, you know, brought that up so many times. But anyways, I want to know your guys' opinion, let me know what you guys think about the lines that I just spoke about. Anyways guys, it's been District Trending, and I'm out, peace.